Today's secret is about how to mount this foam sensor. The foam sensor is a great product which prevents foam from coming from here into this area and now the secret is about how to mount it. In order to install the foam sensor we first have to remove the stopcock. We have to remove any grease if there is any and then we use this tool which is delivered with the foam sensor. We open this one up, we put it like this and we screw this part in like that. We make sure it's tightly fixed like this and we open this back end like that. Now we use the foam sensor and we insert it through that hole just completely. I will talk about that in a minute like this and we keep it open. When mounting the foam sensor it's very important that the tube of the foam sensor, the glass tube, doesn't contact the vapor duct. Therefore I just hold it here in the middle and I make sure that I screw this top. I screw it quite tightly and I release everything. It's very important to adjust the depth of the foam sensor to the flask size and your sample. So the more, the smaller the flask size is like this, you go up with the foam sensor or down if the flask is bigger. In addition, it's very important to adjust these two silver stripes to the horizontal level, like this and not like that. Last but not least, you plug in the foam sensor into this area where it says FS for foam sensor. Together with the foam sensor, you get delivered with this drain disc. This drain disc is used so that the droplets which form on the foam sensor don't go back into the evaporating flask. I would like to show you how to mount this. First, we unscrew the condenser. We take out the foam sensor a little bit. We unscrew this. We take it a little bit up like this. Take the ceiling off. We put the foam sensor back and we put the drain disc on top of the foam sensor like this. We put the ceiling back on. We insert this back into here like that. We tighten it and now we can move this up just slightly so we have the right position. We fix it and now all the droplets with form will go to the drain disc and then drop down into the receiving flask. So that's how easy it is to mount the foam sensor.